trigger points off there. Okay. And I'm going to skip ahead a little bit. You would do maybe 20, 25 deep strokes until you feel satisfied you got some relief in there. The third part is what's called pin and stretch. So we know that it's an extensor muscle, right? If our arm is flexed and we, it's stretched out here, when we do this, the muscle contracts, right? So if we go up to this part, no, here, straighten it out this way. So it's in a contracted, it's in a shortened state here. And then we pin a part of the muscle, press it down and bend the arm up and then let go. Pin it down, stretch it like this, right? And work all along that. The whole point is to pin the muscle down and then take it through a range of motion. This will not only break up the, scar, the, the potential scar tissue, adhesions, and so forth. Within the first session, you should really uh, notice a relief. The pinning and stretching, it may leave, may leave it a little bit tender because we've broken up the scar tissue and so forth that has accumulated over two years, right? Then we're going to start to ease back out of the nervous system. Now we're going to do this again. I would apply lotion again. Now we're pushing stuff up through the lymph system and the blood supply and so forth. Even in here, I'm doing about a pressure size or a pressure <laughs> pressure of three or so to my perception. And this I call the cleaning out or the flushing. We're getting the blood supply in. As we push it out, more comes in, right? Nature pours a vacuum. That kind of thing. And then I'm going to run here real quick and grab an ice cube. The reason that the fiber directions that I originally drew on are important is because before you do the deep, it's called cross fiber friction, you would want to do strokes that are just across the same direction as the, as the fiber. So hold on just a second. So I grabbed an ice cube, and the point is, remember how I was saying we get scar tissue. The faster the body heals, the more it globs up those fibers. So we don't have fibers doing this so much anymore. We have them doing this and this. It's very fast, uh, collagenous uh, healing, but it's very randomized. So we end up with weird scar tissue, right? So what we want to do is polar. It's called polarizing. And back to the direction of the muscle fibers, the way they were drawn on here. 